Like, All right. Um, this morning we have a Daisy Award, and we probably can figure out who it might be. It's going to be for Carrie. Carrie. <laughs> Carrie. So. Yay! I get to see this. Oh my God! I'm so excited. Always the best way to start the day. So as you can tell, Carrie is our Daisy Award winner for the month. Yes, let's give her a round of applause. You know what you doing here? I did. He's going to just go check it out. <laughs> so, um, we haven't been here for a little bit, so let me just tell everybody and make sure your family knows a little bit about Daisy. So Daisy was um, an award that was started in the year 2000 by the family of Patrick Barnes. Patrick was a 33-year-old gentleman who was a husband, fairly good father, who after eight weeks of being sick with uh, autoimmune disease, passed away in the Seattle area. And so the family, as they unfortunately had to watch Patrick pass away, um, were so um, impressed by the nurses' technical skills um, and their competencies, but what really touched them to their core was the compassion that the nurses shared with Patrick and with all of them. And so they tell the story that one night after Patrick passed away over a liquid dinner, um, they thought, what could we do to honor the nurses? And so they came up with the Daisy Award, Diseases Attacking the Autoimmune System. And they figured it would be a local award in Seattle, but now it's in every state in the United States and even an international award. Um, and today, Carrie is getting that award. So, are you <laughs> All right, I had surgery on January 12th and got to my mom shortly before shift change. Got to my room shortly before shift change that evening on 4 West. Carrie was the night nurse for three nights. Um, she made me those she made those first few nights easier for me. She was friendly, caring, encouraging, compassionate, skilled and attentive. I feel she did everything. She cared for me to and make me comfortable. She worked to the she worked the first night I was in the hospital, but on the other end of the hall, she took the time to come and check on me to see how I was doing um, when she ended her shift. I had good care all the time I was in the hospital, but I will always remember Carrie's kindness. Oh, that says it all. <laughs> Okay. Does that ring a bell? <laughs> yeah. yeah. So it's that compassionate and caring. So thank you very much for being a Daisy yeah. nurse. Now, Daisy comes with prizes. So um, you receive this bag and then a portfolio signed by the Barnes family and myself. And um, you have a banner with your name on it for a month. Daisy pin, which you should wear very proudly, and Kleenex, because usually there's never a dry eye in the place, but you're doing pretty good. <laughs> Daisies somewhere. Right those, here, right here. There you go. There are your daisies. And you. cinnamon rolls, because um, Patrick's uh, father told the story that when Patrick was in the hospital and could still eat, Patrick's That's father one day nothing. brought in one of those Are gooey you warm here? Cinnabon, you know, you've had a Cinnabon, and Patrick said, oh, I'll take a bite of that, and proceeded to eat the whole thing. So asked his dad to bring in cinnamon rolls for um, him and the nurses for the rest of his hospitalization while he could eat. And so what the Barnes family really wants the nurses to think about when they smell cinnamon, and we smell cinnamon a lot in a lot of things that we do in baking and all kinds of things, is because they said the nurses kept saying, this is just what I do, this is just my work. Um, into our patients and families, it's a whole lot more than that. So they said every time you smell cinnamon, take a minute to think how special you are. So you have cinnamon rolls over there. We don't have cinnabons, so you have high bee cinnamon rolls. And then probably one of the things that I think is the neatest gift is this is a statue called the Healer's Touch. Um, and this is handmade by artists in Zimbabwe, and your artist has signed it right there. And healers are very, very important in their culture, so they're honored to make these for Daisy because of how important healers are to them, but also um, Daisy's partnership with these artists feeds many, many families in this very impoverished nation. So um, we're so very proud of you. Do you want to say anything to the crowd? No. <laughs> <laughs> I love working here and I've had amazing mentors. I've been back and thank you very much for being a great co-worker. Awesome, well thank 
you for being a day dinner. We appreciate it very much. Yeah, thank you. Family. One more round. Yeah. 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 Yeah.